the nigga Puff was like, yeah, like first he was hamping him to, to right. get stout. Then he was like, yo, he's like, yo, so yo, when we gonna get the chance to, you know, to kick it, like we could just hang out, nigga. We gotta, we gotta Hold kick that. it. This is Puff. Okay. He telling me we gotta kick it and shit. And he was like, right. yo, why don't we like go shopping or some shit? I mean, like I pay for it. And I was like, what the fuck, this nigga just say. <laughs> <laughs> I got the fuck away from him because I was like, this, this nigga, like, fuck it. Wait, this nigga just tell me he take me shopping. <laughs> and this is the shit, this is shit that goes off. But this is a little fruit pop. Pop is a fruit pop. <laughs> Trust me. You see these little weird ass pictures and shit like that out there? I'm just sitting out there for no reason. Yo, you don't see actual pictures of me like kissing it. Like that doesn't happen by accident. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Look, look. Later you gonna find out a little shit that I'll be saying. Do you understand what I'm saying? Man, listen. I'm trying to tell you the truth. But the truth, sometimes it hurts. Right. It hurts people and they don't want to hear that shit. But I'm trying to tell you. Nah. Nigga asked me, could he take me shopping? And it fucked me up because nah. I'm looking like, what the fuck did this nigga just say? I want to take you shopping. <laughs> I got a bankroll out this motherfucker. I want to take you shopping. Why? Because when you walk around looking so motherfucking good, I want to feel like, God damn it, that motherfucker with me. <laughs> That's all I want to do. That's all I want to do. But when a nigga tell me he want to take me shopping, what the fuck is the matter with this nigga? <laughs>
basically he would uh, he would masturbate and tell me what to do with Cassie. And I was like a sex slave, okay? For them, that's what I was. That's all, all right? Um, I caught herpes, and I came back, and I seen him for the herpes, and won. But, Didis and Ross, which they good buddies, okay? Mm -hmm. They, they, they're gay. Who? Both. Diddy and Ross. And Khaled. They're all gay. Okay? DJ Khaled, Rick Ross, yeah. and P. Diddy? Yeah. They're all gay? Yeah. Gotcha. All right. I seen the liquid cocaine, I've drank it myself. Having sex with Diddy and Cassie. Okay? It's not good. He drinks it all the time. Alright? He calls it GG. That's liquid cocaine. Alright. I've settled five, four point one to five million dollars with Diddy. I've settled five, four point one to five million dollars with Diddy. Okay? okay? But he's scared that was an explosion. Yep, you heard it right. You heard right. P. Diddy, Ricky Rose, and DJ Khalid. Yeah. I'm just waiting for another shoe to drop about Sean Carter, Jay-Z. Yeah. Who are you talking about, Mr. Brown? What they? They. Look at it. Kareem Akbar. That's right, the educated brother from the bank. He's the real head of the CMB. The brains behind the whole thing. I told you, this thing is bigger than Nino Brown, and I got a list of people. If I'm going down, I'll take a whole lot of people. There's a list of P. Diddy that I believe that all of them need to be looked at. Let's listen to the list. Drake. Yeah. Oprah. Oprah. J-Lo. J-Lo. A-Rod. A-Rod. Will Smith. Will Smith. Yeah. <laughs> Alicia Keys. Alicia Keys. Look at some pretty hair. Black King God, dude. Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber. Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart. Mark Wahlberg. Mark Wahlberg. Snoop. Snoop. DJ Khaled. DJ Khaled. The one, I believe, in my opinion, the catalyst of all this is Oprah Winfrey. Yeah, I know. Oprah Winfrey. She's been friends with Harvey Weinstein. She's a big buddy fan of Obama. And she's a friend of P. Diddy. She's right there in the middle. You feel what I'm saying? I think we need to do an investigation on Oprah Winfrey. For real, for real. Has anybody seen Stedman? Is he alive or did he transition? Because I don't know what's going on over there. But back to Ricky Rose. Ricky Rose has a big problem and it's his baby mama. So we better clock this tea right here. Renee says, you want to stay keeping up shit? We better talk about some real tea. Your brother over there paying people to put hits out. He over there paying people to put hits out. And niggas running off with his money and it's getting back to me. So now, now I'm finna send the feds over there to y'all mother empire. His baby mama knows a lot of secrets. And she's been threatening that she's going to write a tell-all book. And he, she keeps saying, you know I got you. You know what I'm talking about. She keeps saying that. See, you had the right bitch today, ho. You keep playing with me, I'm for the tell y'all motherfucking empire down. Next, we gonna talk about Miss Carol murder. Y'all know who Miss Carol is. You know that's behind your brother. I'm finna make sure her family sue y'all whole estate. Cause that case is not closed. You know the lady that was killed leaving from my mama house, getting her hair done that time. And it's behind your brother and his drama. You know that. You know. You know. About the man who they who, who was killed in front of Black House? Okay. We finna dig up a whole bunch of motherfucking maggots right now, ho. I'm not finna play with you, you Ozempic. I'm finna finish y'all mother. Watch this. So here's the moral of the story, guys. Mamas, don't let your baby grow up to be rappers. No! If you know any young man, 18 or 25, who inspires to be a rapper, he got bars for days, and he want to be in the limelight, you need to slap some reality into him. Okay? Hollywood is dead. It is dead. I am so glad this celebrity culture will be over soon.
All of these uh, big dick deviants is all catching hell in 2024. It's up for all of them. It don't matter if you Diddy or whoever you is. T.G. Jakes, any of them. The, every, all lies will be exposed. That's all. And, and, and anyone who takes that the wrong way know why they take it the wrong way. The truth is the light. I need to have no more of these. Amen, amen. Gee. All right, guys. All I'm saying is be careful. You know, you want to be famous so bad, they're going to get you. You're going to do something stupid for some fame. All right, get out of here. Hit that like button. Go it truly is about the Benjamin, yeah. as we see. Oh, yeah, he's he glittering. Uh, he's chilling. He's glittering. About yeah. Well, now, when we come back, we're going to talk more with Puffy. And if you want to hang out, more than welcome. Stick around, my brother. Oh, All right, we'll be right back with more right after this.